everyone, just on my way out to Everton and just uh, just saw the boss's um, uh, press conference and I've got to say it's very, very, it's very refreshing to see some of the, here I should say, see him and hear some of the things he's saying. He doesn't sugarcoat anything, you know, you have to say that under previous management we, we wouldn't hear the truth. We would hear, yes, we're going to go for this player and we're trying to go for this great player and that player. From Unai, we heard last January him saying, well, we're going to only get in loans. That's all we're able to get. And hopefully we'll be able to sign people. But what we're seeing from him now, somebody telling us he wants top level players. He wants the kind of players that are going to take this club to the next level. We've got great youth, uh, youth players and academy players that should be great news to people like Reese Nelson and Emil Smith Rowe that he wants to promote them and bring them in. And it's great to see a manager who is not sugarcoating, like I say, he's telling us exactly what's going on. And I think that he should be trusted in respect of what he's saying and what he wants to do. Because when you look at where we are now, um, and, and, and I, I remember at the start of the season, I said I would have taken six. I would have taken it in his first year, transitional year, trying to get the players to play a different system. But for him to be challenging for what he's doing now in respect of where we are is absolutely fantastic. And that is why I know that Mez hasn't played an away game since Boxing Day. And if he believes that Mez shouldn't start today, which I'd love to see him start, don't get me wrong. Um, if he thinks he shouldn't start, then we have to trust that. But I do believe that Mez will make some form of impact. Mez will make some form of impact. And that's what I'm pleased about. I was up the training ground the other day with the guys and there seems to be such an unbelievable atmosphere up there and belief. I'm not bothered and how we get the result today. You know, I'm watching Liverpool at the moment just get by, just doing what needs to be done. Mad Max football, I call it, you know, by any means necessary. I think it's going to be a tough game now um, on my way up to Everton to watch it because um, Everton themselves are playing pretty well and our away form hasn't been great. But I think that might change today. But like, we're doing some Malcolm X football now by any means necessary because seven games to go any Arsenal fan talked, would have been absolutely delighted to take this scenario right now at the start of the season so fingers crossed we can get this done you know what I'm going to do I'm going to do a video afterwards to see the before and the after fingers crossed it's great stuff <laughs> hey guys if you like that video Hit subscribe, click on the bell icon, keep up to date with all my new videos.